video is just going to be a little chit chat, a little catch up because I haven't posted in so long. I have so many videos that I recorded in, in August, September. When was the last time I posted? I think it was at the end of August or September. I don't know. It's been a while because I... <laughs> always will it's just some I was just panic looking for my phone that I'm currently filming on um, you know I just love you know what that's a lie I do see a lot of kids go to the library so I will I'll give them that I really wanted to rent some books that are in Spanish I got of mice and men in Spanish so I can practice my Spanish and I also got this book I've read books by her before pa Paula Sanz Calasanz it's called in la tierra de los primeros besos like what it means um, in the land of first kisses which beautiful love that uh, and I'm really excited I also went to Goodwill <laughs> And yes, I do have a problem. And look at this. Guess what's in here? That's right. Books. But come on, this was a good buy. Look at that. And it's, this was $3. And it's in amazing condition. I also got, are we gonna do a haul? Okay. Um, Charles Dickens Christmas stories, or Christmas books, which includes Christmas Carol. Uh, Maya Angelou, Heart of a Woman. Hamlet because duh and then the portrait of a lady because I used to read this book all the time because it was one of the first big girl books that I was allowed to read and I would rent it I actually rented it from this library that I'm at right now and I would read it and it's pretty scandalous <laughs> or it was scandalous for me being a 13 year old reading that I was like oh my god so much scandal so much drama I'm really happy like I haven't felt this much joy ew I'm feeling emotional <laughs> I haven't felt this much joy about a simple activity in so long I used to visit my university's library all the time look you guys I got a new I even had to get a new library card can't see it. Um, uh, the last time I was at this library was probably in high school, I think. Since I graduated, I was just using my university library. And now that I'm back in my hometown, I, I need to go to libraries because I, I love them. It's just, it's so fun, nostalgic. You get to, you get to read books for free. Like who doesn't love that? I hope to one day be in a place financially where I can donate a huge chunk of money to this
this library as, long, as well as the library that I used to go to growing up in, uh, in Hawaii. Beautiful. They just have a special little place in my heart and I love them. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go before I start crying over a freaking library. You know, I didn't think I'd be so emotional about it, but I'm really, 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 really excited to have a new book. Ooh, there's a Biden Harris event over there. Huh. Thank goodness. My town is so weird. It's literally a salad. There's a little bit of everything. There's prejudice, there's racists, but there's also intelligent people who rise above and learn and know better. There's a lot of support for uh, Trump and there's a lot of support for Biden. I, I seriously don't know what my town will be during the election. I, I will not be surprised if it's, if it's a close call. Like I truly won't be surprised. I'd be surprised if it was a majority one person and a minority of the other person because I, I really think it's gonna be a close call. <laughs> um, hopefully that's just for my my town and not what's going to happen. Did I just jinx it? I really hope I didn't. Today is, <laughs> what's, what's the day? I don't know. It's a few days before election, so we'll see. Hopefully I edit this video before election time. <laughs> Maritza, edit this video before election time. And I understand you've been busy, you, you've got a new job, you've been stressed out, you don't want to edit things, you got bullied. <laughs> yeah, I got freaking bullied for my other videos. How stupid is that? Stupid. Some person who shall remain anonymous. <clears throat> uh, I don't even want to talk about them, but you know what? I am. Because I was really pissed. Uh, I post, uh, I guess, I, I have to be okay with any hate that comes my way, right? Um, but this one person in particular has criticized me basically the whole time I've known them. And they had the, the little fun idea to just DM me on a social media platform. And they basically said, you know, Hi, it's me. I decided not to include what they said because it was too obvious. And they thought that they were <laughs> insulting me. You know, I... I know. I've grown a lot. I used to be an annoying ass high schooler. I think I was just lost. You know, everyone was lost in high school and middle school. It was a weird time. I am a hundred percent not the same person I was. I mean, I've taken some good qualities that I had in high school or middle school and I've adapted them and this person knew me at that time so they have this idea that I'm still that person which is fair <laughs> when our uh, friendship or relationship we had ended I became a little obsessed with being portrayed as I was fine as like I was better than them no yeah that's what it was I wanted to be better than them I wanted to them to think that I was over that part of my life, that friendship, relationship, whatever it was. Anyways, <laughs> this person had the audacity to message me and say and say that and it kind of bothered me only because I haven't talked to this person in I don't even know how long. I, I want to say seven years seven years but and this is what they choose to talk to me about like bitch okay i'm sorry i'm sorry um no i'm not sorry i i need to stop being sorry i'm not sorry you know i have fun editing these videos i like posting them so i'm going to do that i'm just scared of what people think and i really shouldn't you know i'm just doing this for fun because it is fun you know i i have this creative side of me. I usually get to express it through my work or my assignments. I really love writing. There's a lot of people around me now. Whatever. I love writing and I love painting. I'm not good at it. Trust me, I, I suck. I think I'd like to say that I've gotten better at filming and I've made it a little bit easier for myself to edit. 
and I, I just felt discouraged and I've been stressed with, oh, you know, life, um, just with personal things and, you know, things that I'm sure a lot of people are struggling with. Finding a place in your, in the world. <laughs> Cause I, for so long, was a student and to have that taken away from me abruptly and then having to stay at home and then graduating but not really because it was really weird because I didn't get a graduation so it was kind of like I didn't get to close that part of my life the way I wanted to and I know a lot of people feel like that and it's hard and I just needed to take some time for me <laughs> and no one probably cares. I, oh, but I do want to say, is that lame? No, it's not lame. I'm really excited for the 40 subscribers I have. I was not expecting that at all. I'm like, I have 40 freaking subscribers. Am I okay? Why am I getting, I'm fine. I was getting a little choked up, but I, I'm back. Don't worry. Um, I was truly only expecting my mom and three of my friends to subscribe and I have 40 that's awesome <laughs> um, but yeah thank you guys I like this little niche community we have and I'm going to be better and I'm going to post more I think it's been a month yeah I think it has been a month and I will I'm making a promise to myself that I will post the videos that I filmed I, I'm going to start a new workout series so I filmed the Chloe Ting two-week shred, the 2020 Chloe Ting two-week shred challenge. So I will be editing that. I went to the Yosemite with my friends, so I'll be posting that soon. I'm just gonna be posting a bunch of random things until I figure out exactly what I wanna do. I'm just gonna post stuff that I enjoy watching. I enjoy watching people cook. I enjoy people dyeing their hair. I enjoy people painting. I enjoy, I enjoy vlogs, so I think I'm gonna start doing more of that. I also enjoy watching reaction videos, so maybe I'll do that. I don't know, I I don't have a lot of storage on my phone. So yeah, thank you for watching this little car chit chat book review <laughs> video. I will see you guys very soon. You, no, I will see you guys next week. I promise, I don't know what day of the week, but I will start posting once a week, at least. I'll try to do more, but I'm go I, I know I can do at least once a week. All right, thank you for watching and have a <laughs> have a good day. This lighting is pretty bad. Be kind to yourself. You know, love yourself. Your body is amazing. It keeps you alive and it's not said enough. Be grateful for at least one thing each day. Um okay, there's a man looking at me. <laughs> and I feel weird, so I am, oh, I just made really weird eye <sighs> Okay, I'm gonna go. Bye! Thank you for watching.